Good afternoon, it's Beer O'Clock again. Ortiz Beer Reviews. Now, Camden Town Brewery with their little Marmite. Love or hate, eh? Love, hate, yep. Yeah. 4.8% ABV. Marmite L. Um, there's a beer yeast in Marmite, and there's Marmite in this beer. Brewed with people, uh, pearl hops. Same as our classic Hell's Lager. In other words, it's not that good. <laughs> <laughs> we recently added real marmite along with toasted pilsner and Munich malt for a smoky bready balance so whether you love it or hate it it works just as well as marmite on toast we'll toast to that well, okay see. well well i was really interested in this although i love a bit of marmite i do love marmite myself i must admit i have marmite crisps marmite peanuts marmite on toast marmite sandwiches marmite rice cakes yeah, pretty much everything my might mm -hmm. that I can get my grubby little hands on, I have. Right, I'm excited about this because it's my might, but then I saw someone else's review because I was took ages to turn up. And also, it's, it's candy. Five pound the extra delivery as it's, well. Yeah, yeah, five pound delivery, <laughs> yeah, I know. It's Camden Town, I mean, I'm not being funny, but um, I'm more of a Beaver Town man, if you know what I mean. <laughs> That's just... Not go there on that one. I used to like the Camden Hills, and then I realised it was a um, South London beer brewed in North London, which don't make sense. They should stick Camden down at Woolwich. But there you go. Let's give this a try. It actually smells of a hint. Of <laughs> it smells more like well, like, oh, it's dark. To the review that I saw, it said it didn't smell of marmite. Definitely does. Good carbonation. Mm. I've definitely done that as well. Yeah, definitely. Foamy head actually. Right, let's have a look at the can first because, of course, it's marmite, so they've got to do the traditional kind of marmite looking thing. Let's have a look at that. That looks kind of cool. Love it or hate it? Yeah. I wonder if we will. And there we go. Look at the colour of that. That's very dark. There's still good carbonation coming off it. You won't see it on the video, I don't think, because it's so dark. But that's a good foamy head on it. So, okay, who's got? I think I can actually smell Marmite a little Definitely. bit. No, I can smell it. Yeah, I can smell it. I can smell Marmite, and it is like. Yeast and hops. Maybe some kind of weirdo and go and sniff in someone's toast and yeah, I think you could probably smell it. I like chili marmite on my toast, the new one, till I realised it costs four pounds rather than two pounds sixty and bearing in effect I could just stir my chili. Could, yeah, you could just sprinkle it with chili and in I think own. it'd probably have a little bit more effect, but here we go. And give it it's a bit all of garlic. Yep, even if it is Camden Town. Who's going first? You being the boss. Let's see, finally accepts it. Let's try this. Yeah, I really am picking up more. Let's see if I can taste it. Oh, okay. Did, did you pick up any more? Go on, you go. You keep doing that, didn't you? <laughs> like a little game to you, isn't it? But the smell it smells marmite. It smell. does, yeah. Oh, <laughs> very, 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 very malty. I don't know about marmite, but 
it, it is there. But I read someone else's review. These, funny enough, it was a bloke and a girl. Some bloke and some blonde-headed girl. And they uh, said it's nothing like my mind. It does have a... It's a very... It, it tastes stronger than the 4.8 volume that it is. Okay. This is how it's okay. starting off for me. You don't have I, like me now. I'm always very... Um, whatever the word is when you flap around. So. On the first taste, you are getting Marmite. That is what I am predominantly tasting. The first hint of flavour on my tongue, I am getting Marmite. Um, and then it follows on and it has a kind of um, rich, creamy, yeasty taste that isn't Marmite. It's something else. Well, it's ale. Yeah, but it's not hoppy. There's no bitterness to it. It's very mm, creamy. But it's not as bad. It's not as bad as it looks, is it? It's not as bad as what was said in that review. That is definitely marmite. <laughs> I had fast fast once, twenty four hours, and I'm absolutely starving. All I could have was fluids, and I got really hungry. So I put some marmite in hot water, and I thought it's going to be like just, you know, marmitey hot water. And it might quench my hunger a little bit. And it did taste very much like this, but without the alcohol. So I'm actually going to give the marks for it really tasting of Marmite because it does. And it's, I've just had a second taste. Listen to this. I've just had my second taste and I was getting Marmite after taste. And yet we saw, I told you we shouldn't watch other people's reviews. Because everyone's going to have their own opinion on things. Yeah, I, don't, I, I don't agree with everyone. Like, oh, you're wrong. That's. Well, I'm never That's what wrong. you taste. <laughs> no, actually, I think we all taste things differently. And Marmite is exactly one of those things. You either love it or hate it. I can smell it. I can definitely taste it, especially on, on the first sip. Well, I'm saying for the Woolwich Brewers, that's not bad. It's good. It is. It's very Marmite-y. And then it, 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 it's subtle and it's a creamy um, ale kind of finish. Do you know that is actually very drinkable, much more so than I thought it would well, be. Well, if we ever did homebrew again, I wanted to do a Marmite brew because we all love Marmite, <laughs> don't we? And I, I saw that, as I say, and I thought, wow. And then I saw the review, which we probably shouldn't have watched, as I say. But they were just saying it's, it's nothing like Marmite, which is rubbish. It smells like Marmite. Maybe they had COVID. Maybe they, because Marmite is very predominant. It's like when you spread your marmite on toast, you spread it on a bat niche. Whereas when I spread it on, I have to have a very thin layer because I like it to be subtle, not overpowering. It is subtle in this beer, not overpowering, but it is definitely there. And they've actually combined it really well. And I hate to say that about this um, brewery because they're not my particular favourites either. <laughs> But I do like Marmite, and I do like the way they've done this. That's cool. I'm, I'm sorry, Tottenham. Hate to say it, but I love this drink. Did you get the pun there? Huh? <laughs> See, way over is it? Pull up, I was looking at my phone. Mm -hmm. Why are you all giving but me yeah. a gamble? No, actually, I'm glad I've got a couple more of these drinks. Well, it's actually, very good. we, we. It's, if you like Marmite, you, sh you should do, you should like this. There is no reason not to. It's actually halfway decent, isn't it? I'm always put off by the colour because I'm a like bit of a weirdo, as she says. But you know, one of them things. But I expect to, to tie that out because you're not my camera. Yeah, don't knock the camera. Out. Come on, baby, out, out, out. 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 Don't knock the camera. <laughs> He's a Rottweiler with the most hugest tail that uh, just sends everything flying. So, on the old camera goes. Yeah, off it goes. Off goes the tripod. Mm -hmm. Off goes Tiger. And then he buggers up. He might like this because he likes mine. He, he would love that. But yeah, so different to what we expected. This is going to get just purely because I so didn't think I'd like it. Um, he was telling me it's seen views. People say it doesn't taste the Marmite. For me, it does. I can smell it in the aroma. I can taste it. The actual 
ale is very good as well. There's no bitterness, it's creamy, it's smooth. Um, it's better than it looks, definitely. The novelty factor, uh, the way they've combined it, which I think is great. I'm giving this a name, and it's a yes. Hey? Yeah. Didn't think it was that nice. Jesus. I think it's a really good collaboration between uh, a brewery and Marmite. I think it's really good. Yeah. Shame it won't be the town, but we have to live with that. Can't be more. Unfortunately, but yeah, for Woolwich Brewery, I'll say a definite yes, and it pains me to do it because, like, I didn't chuck away the Camden Town glasses. <laughs> so, on a one way trip, shall we say? But yeah, I'll give it a yes, and yeah, look, malt, Pilsner, Ranch, Munich, Hops, Pearl, and ye Owl Yeast, made from Marmot. I'll give it a yes and I'll give it a 7 out of 10. Much surprised. Much, pretty much impressed. So, yeah. Well done, Woolwich. <laughs> oh, sorry, Candy. <laughs> You've actually won something. Yeah. You go, yay. <laughs> there you go. Not often. Right. Not this season, anyway. Like, subscribe, and let us know your thoughts if you tried this. Bonjour, people. <laughs> See you next time.